guys welcome back thank you for watching thank you all for liking and subscribing happy new year's eve so we're gonna do a little smoky glitter look today i'm gonna be going back and forth between my 39l hippo lights palette and i don't know if i want to use my aurora lights palette for my corners or if i want to go in with my mermaid glitter palette you'll just have to watch and find out okay so let's go ahead and conceal our eyes Okay, so I'm taking my translucent powder and like always I'm just going to set my eye where I put that concealer. And I'm just going in with my fluffy Eco Tools brush, which once again guys, these are like super soft. So for this black smoky eye that I'm gonna do, I am gonna go in So I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna grab my Kiss gel liner. It is like the little black gel liners. I'm gonna grab one of my little flat brushes and spread that all over my lid. Actually, I'm gonna grab a sponge brush. Those tend to work better for this liner. Okay, so I'm gonna really pack the liner onto the sponge because this is basically gonna be our lid base for this black smoky eye. Remember, it's okay if it's messy because it's a smoky eye, we're gonna blend that out. Okay, and then after that, I am gonna go in with my fluffy blending brush. I do <clears throat> have a multiples, but right now, I've always kind of really liked the Anastasia little blending brush. I'm just gonna go with that and basically smoke out that liner that I put. So, I do think I'm gonna go into the 39L palette and I'm gonna smoke that out with the color hookup. Actually, no, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use Makeup Sesh. And just gently blend that out. I'm gonna do the other eye and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I went ahead and did the other eye. So <clears throat> after I blended it out with Makeup Sesh, I am gonna go back into that gel liner and just repack some of this black on my lid because I am gonna go in with that color. Hold on, what's the name of it again? Okay, it's the color Obsessive in the 39L Hit the Lights palette. It's this really shimmery black one right here. And then I'm also gonna be going in with this one right here, Till Dawn. Kind of going back and forth, adding shimmer and depth to the smoky eye. But first, let me take a selfie. Just kidding. Okay, taking that liner and go ahead and put a little bit more 
on my lid just to darken that up. So I'm gonna go in again with this little flat brush, go into that color obsessive, Ooh. and just pack that onto my lid. I don't know if you can tell yet, but it does have a little bit of that shimmer to it. Like so. And I'm going back in with that blending brush. And just gonna... And I'm going to take that same color makeout sesh and I'm going to just gently grab some and re-blend out those few edges that look a tad harsh. So after taking that, I want to go in and I'm gonna go do my face real quick and I will be right back. Okay, scratch that, I totally forgot. So I do need to go in and I'm gonna grab my little pencil liner. I can get to it. Okay. Then I'm just gonna basically put it on my under upper waterline but to do that I just go to my inner corner and then drag it across the top as my eye is like shaking <laughs> but it it does the job Like so. And then I'm gonna go back in with that little flat brush. And I'm gonna grab that same color till dawn uh, and mixing it with obsessive. And just gently smoke out my under eye. And I'm gonna go in with a little, another little flat glitter brush. And I'm thinking that I want to go into my all that decisions. glitter from my little mermaid glitter palette and I'm thinking that I want to use a few moments later okay I'm gonna use that same color it's called the halo effect it's in the morphe palette I believe it is one of their highlighter colors <clears throat> Okay. 
and I'm just going to pop that in my inner corner. Okay, so that's not as shiny as I thought it was going to be. So I'm going to scratch that. <laughs> and I think I'm going to go into my Aurora Lights palette and I'm going to grab that color. Let's grab flashing and put that right on the inner corner. Yeah. So I kind of use my little flat brush when I'm doing my inner corner. I use my flat brush like a fan. So I take it and I pack it right there, drag it down into blend it into my under eye, and then I fan it gently. I'm kind of like smoking it into the colors that you already have on your eye. And then I'm gonna go take this mermaid glitter palette and I'm going to grab this really, it's got some actually probably rainbow, little rainbow flecks all throughout it. Really iridescent silvery glitter color. It's like Love Bomb in the 39L Hit the Lights palette, but it's a little bit more chunky and has a little bit more color instead of just being all silver. I'm just going to pack that into my inner corner. And then the same thing like I did with the... I'm just going to fan that out. Okay, and then I'm going to go back in with my pencil liner and line the bottom of my eyes. I just use my pinky to pull it down and I will fill in my waterline like that. Like so. Okay, so I'm gonna do my face real quick and then I will be right back, guys. Okay, so I went ahead and did my face. I did my foundation and I did my powder. Now I just need to do my blush, my highlight, and my lips. I'm gonna go back in with my CoverGirl Cheekers blush and my blush brush from EcoTools. Just gently. And just circle motions. And then repeat on the other side. And I do put a little bit of blush on my nose. Just in the under part. my little highlighter brush from Eco Tools, and I'm gonna go back in with my Route 21 highlighter palette and just pick up that silver and obviously it's New Year's so I do want to be a little extra glowy tonight so put some setting spray on first that dry, pick up some more of that highlighter. Just, ooh. Yeah, see, 
that's the difference between your highlighter being glowy and natural. And I am putting some on my cupid's bow as well. Okay. I'm also going to take my little tiny highlighter brush. I'm gonna grab that same silver color and kind of just not put it over the glitter but in this very little tiny spot right here where you see it start to get a little dark from the glitter. I'm just gonna gently See how you can see the shadow on this side, but this side you don't. That's what this little trick is. And take that same brush and I'm gonna grab my little bit it's not it's a little bit wider of a highlighter and just gently put that under my eyebrows on my brow bone just to give it a little bit more glow because who doesn't want to look like the disco ball dropping on New Year's Eve right Okay, so now that I'm done with my eyes, I'm just gonna go do my eyelashes and my lips, and I will be right back, guys. Okay, guys, so this is the finished look. I went ahead and added my falsy eyelashes. I added top and bottom mascara, and I went ahead and added my Wet n Wild Liquid Catsuit uh, Behind the Bleachers lipstick. Wand curled my hair, used my little glass stone on my eyes for a little bit just to bring down my bag's puffiness, which this stuff has actually been working pretty good, I think. Um, hope everybody has a good Happy New Year's Eve. Everybody stay safe. No drunk driving. Don't forget there's Uber and Lyft. And I hope that when everybody starts their new year that they not only get what they want, but maybe that there is something that you've been holding back or been wanting to change about yourself. I hope that you get the strength and the motivation to do it, guys.